Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So in today's video, I'm going to be going over one of the best money making methods and a guide as to how you can do it and make consistent money while doing it and all the gear you need, etc, etc, etc. Either way, please consider subscribing. This intro is not going to be super long, but please consider subscribing. I really, it would really mean the world to me. Also, Discord link in description. Go join that. Let's hit 2k subs before fall break. Let's get into the video. Alright, so this money making method is a consistent money making method that should be able to make you a bunch of profit if you do it correctly and like 100% of the time. It is consistent. This method is prices don't fluctuate a whole lot, it's just very consistent. What is this? This is squid fishing. Now, if you know what this is, then you already know what it is. But what it is, is you have a bunch of different stuff, and you try to fish up squids. reason you try to fish up squids is because the price of ink is so high. Like, so high for, a, for the price of ink. So the goal is to fish up as much ink and as much squids as you can, to make as much profit as you, well, can. And there's a few things you need to do in order to do this. First, the gear. You need your usual fishing gear. I'm going to be using salmon armor, but eventually I'll upgrade that. I'm using epic version because, hey, flex, why not? But you also want you to use a squid hat because it gives you extra chance to fish up squids. So, fishing armor and then the squid hat for your gear. Also, I'd use just using, well, you know, a rod. So, I'm going to use fishing rod. Or, sorry, what the? No, shit, I'm using fishing rod myself. Uh, Falter rod of the sea. And I'm going to be using fish bait because I find that it's just nice to fish things up a lot faster. But you can use whatever you want to use. Now, for pets, there is one pet you're going to want to use. Another pet that might be optional. The pet that you want to use is the squid pet. Reason for this being is it gives percent drops. So, 50% chance to deal... Wait, what? That's his Jerry pet. Sorry. 52% chance to get double drops from squids, meaning you can make a lot more money if you have squid pet on. Now, something else you can do is you can do double pet stacking. So, have a, so have a pet with high, high damage and just use it to, well, fish. And then instantly you fish something up, have it switch to your squid pet so using auto pet rule. Now, you don't have to do this, but you can if you want to. As for where you want to be, you want to be in this area for two reasons. A, I just find that it's nice, and also because of Vanessa. With Vanessa, you can summon in rain every $5,000 for every minute, which is definitely worth it because you make so much of that money back. And you want to fish up squids. Now, the reason you want to do it in this area is because squids occasionally will naturally spawn, so, you know, more squids, and rain makes you fish faster. So, there's just a bunch of different reasons why you want to do it in this area. But once again, to recap, you're going to want a fishing rod, fishing armor, with a squid hat, and a squid pet. You can use another pet like the Ammonite, the Dolphin pet, if you want to switch. Switch, fish, switch, you know, have the, all that sort of stuff. But it's really your call. So I'm going to get into five minutes of me actually doing this method. So you guys can see how profitable it actually is. Now, instead of using a total, I mean, if this was normal salmon armor, would cost me around like 2 million coins. Uh, no, more like the four mil. The reason being is the Rod of the Sea and the Squid Pet. Those are the only two expensive things in the setup I'm using. Everything else is very much so cheap. So that is going to be using the setup I'm going to be using for this event. I'm going to buy five, five, probably maybe six months of rank because it's going to take me a little bit to get everything set up. Using Fish Bait. If you want to use Whale Bait or Spiked Bait or whatever bait you want to use, go ahead and do it. But I'm going to be using Fish Bait for this. And uh, yeah. I'll get into the montage at the very end of the video if you want to see it because I don't want to waste your time. Let's get into it. All right. So I just finished fishing up for five minutes. There was a little bit more, but either way, I fished up switch out fishing for five minutes and I got a hydro at the very end, but I didn't drop anything good, which is kind of sad, but A, that's fine. So from five minutes of fishing, I was able to get 16,000 coins from my purse. And that does not seem right. Hold on. All right. So I'm just going to empty out my uh, fishing sack so we can get a more accurate representation. But, okay, that is accurate. 
I made 250,000 coins from 5 minutes of squid fishing. 250,000 coins in 5 minutes. So I made 250,000 coins in 5 minutes, which totals out to be around 3 million plus coins every single hour. And I'm not using that max out of a setup. I mean, I'm using salmon armor and a rod of the sea. It's not that good. If I was using better armor, I'd get a, you'd get a lot better results if you were wearing diver or shark or, you know, actual armor and actual fishing pet. You would get a lot better results. However, it's still pretty impressive that you're able to make so much money from fishing up squids. And I do have to mention how much money I spent on the rain from Vanessa. I spent 25,000 coins, so I made net profit of 225,000 coins, which is still really good. But either way, I highly recommend if you want to do this for either fishing EXP, it doesn't give a whole lot money or leaderboard whatever it is i do recommend doing this as it is incredibly nice to do and you know you can get your collection up if you so want now the reason squid fishing is so good i'm sure i talked about this earlier is because of the price it costs like a hundred per ink sack we can see the main i made like literally all my money from the ink sacks because it's crazy good either way um i'll see i'll see you guys next one and uh yeah Peace.